Hello everyone, Trina here from there is the card for that.ca and today is the 13th of July and yesterday I received my June Simon Says Stamp kit. So I'm not posting this late. Um, I literally just got it in the mail yesterday. So I'm not entirely certain what the delay was because that's really weird. Um, but it's here now and I'm super stoked about it. Honestly, I can't even remember what's in it. Like, it's been that long. So this will be fun for everybody. Okay, so we have our fun little candy in Jerry this time. So that's, that's fun. And then let's see, let's see what we have here. Okay, so we have this watercolor, goodbye winter, so long snow, it's time to watch the flowers grow, which will be good because we like flowers, right? You've seen my stuff. I like flowers. It's good. And that's on uh, watercolor paper. Uh, so that's nice. Uh, let's put that over here so I don't lose it because you can't see it, but everything outside of this viewing area is a disaster. Um, we have a 3D embossing folder, and I've never had a 3D embossing folder, so I don't know what it's like. It looks like gold leaf. It's very thick. Oh, wow. That's super thick. That's super thick. That'll be so pretty. I'm thinking this on um, a white, white cardstock. I guess it goes this way up. That makes sense. And then using the little daubers to sponge or chalks, that would be that would be really nice for a background or even how they have it on here with the gold foiled cardstock. That'll be that'll be lovely. We have some oh, this looks like a sorry your stuff was late late stickers, but they match, so yay! Extra puppy stickers by Pebbles. And there's 20 of them in here. That's really nice. That was nice. Thanks guys. That was super nice. So I actually ended up having to email and say, uh, it's almost July and I haven't received my card kit yet. And then they sent me tracking information and it still took two weeks. And then I was really sad and now it's here. So yay. Um, I did opt out of the July kit. Um, just because that one, that one didn't speak to me as much. So we have two pearlescent envelopes. And I'm not going to lie, the last few kits that I've gotten have these envelopes. And I haven't used them once. I have been hoarding them. Because that's what I do. So, um, we have some 6 by 6 paper here. And I think that is from the fly and scrap and single-sided would be good for like an ocean or a background or oh that's really pretty I might just find a six by six frame and hang that on my wall <laughs> um, I struggle I struggle with pattern paper and it's so pretty and I love it so much and I have so much of it especially in the six by six because I only typically make cards but I struggle with it very much like how would I even cut that for a card like that but then what would I put in front of it I struggle I don't know why I can watch YouTube videos and look at other people's blogs and it's still uh, something I gotta work on we all have that right uh, so here we have a giant six by eight Simon says stamp beautiful flowers stamp set and it's got this gorgeous one and that is that's giant uh, where's that envelope so standard size envelope and it would definitely stick all the way around it so that would be fun I think that would be nice for a distress resist kind of thing um, that would be that would be good and then happy birthday happy beloved or happy loved loved <laughs> joy beautiful wishing you on your day sending lots of from all of us 
you are a treasure to me. Love and hugs. I don't know if you can hear that, but my daughter's playing Jenga upstairs and it's so loud. So that's what the crashing is, if you can hear it. If you can't, then just ignore me, because I can hear it. Um, you are so birthday and kind. I love the different fonts and the different sizes, and I cannot wait to start watercoloring these, which I think is what they had in mind, because they provided us with Danielle Smith watercolor paints in Quinn... A credon? I don't know how to say that. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Red, Prussian blue, and Orolin cobalt yellow. And I probably butchered all of those names, so you have my apologies. Uh, that's just very nice. Um, what else do we have in here? Envelopes, the metallic cornflower blue and metallic white, which we saw. And the first thing was the custom Simon Says Stamp watercolor card design by Susie Plantamura. Plantamura. I'm very sorry if you're watching this and I have just not pronounced your name correctly. I'm not very awesome at it. Um, then we have one sheet of Tonic Gold Pearl Mirror Cardstock Satin Effect. And that's that's really nice. I think I would use that for like things. There's only one, so <laughs> you know I'm gonna hoard it. Like I'm not gonna do a background with this. That'd be that'd be a really gold background first off, but I'll probably use like little tiny strips and little circles and just little accent pieces. Um and then one each of Simon says stamp paper um, in the 120 pound white and then 100 pound in the cornflower blue smoke and peacock which are just gorgeous and then finally there is a bottle of Tim Holtz distress resist spray texture re textured resist spray and I've never tried this so I'm super excited probably when I watercolor to use this it's going to be it's going to be super fun I've seen a bunch of videos with it and um, yeah, I'm really excited and I think it might dry pearlescent unless that's just my lighting. It could be my lighting. I don't know if you can see that. Um, but it seems kind of mother of pearl and it comes in one fluid ounce. So that should last a good long time. So I'm pretty excited about that. And so that is the June Simon Says Stamp Fly Me Away card kit. Um, I'm very sorry about how late it is. Um, and... I guess they are too, because I got these pretty We Apologize for the Delay stickers, and I'm super stoked about those, and look at how cute that is. Wouldn't that be cute with the Lawn Fawn Panda that we just seen in my other video? <laughs> That'd be great. Um, so yeah, that's about all, and I can't wait to start getting crafty. My schedule is starting to smooth out a little bit, so I'm hoping to have my weekends back, which means I can actually be more in, in my art room more, which would be lovely. So. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button and the like button and the thumbs up button and comment and my blog will be posted down below along with my Facebook page. I hope you have a super amazing day. Bye.